The National Firearms Registry was proposed again after the tragic shooting deaths of two young police officers and a Good Samaritan neighbour in Weambilla in southern Queensland at the end of last year. In the wake of that tragedy, there was a huge political push for a National Firearms Registry that would allow police officers across the country to check a weapons licence and what weapons were licensed to them, no matter where in the country they it were. It stalled in a bureaucratic fight between the states, the territories and the federal government over who will pay. I'm Sarah Elks, I'm a journalist with the Australian newspaper. This week the paper launches a special series of stories looking at the push for a national firearms registry and issues with gun laws in the states and territories.